Um, I like. What was going on? What was happening when you wrote that? I'm going to have to throw back to the 90s and say, I like my God. <laughs> okay. You know, I interviewed Timmy Gatlin, who actually wrote it. And, and, and um, yeah. He, he, yeah, I mean, it, it's... I kind of schooled Jalen on Timmy Gatlin because, you know, the first CD you see his picture, but then you won't ever see him again. Yeah. And so, um, I think I saw your interview because I've always wondered what happened to Timmy. I never knew. He just disappeared. So to hear the story of how, you know, he was asked to leave and things <laughs> of that nature, I'm like, wow, who, like, that's amazing. Yeah. I know. I'm 50 something years old. And I'm like, I'm just now finding out like what happened to Timmy. Yeah. It, it was hard to hear that, you know, you know, and that's, that's, I mean, yeah, you, mean it, you have no idea what it's like being an artist today. Yeah. To back then where, you know, a manager comes in and says you're out the group and, 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 and stuff the group that you formed so it yeah, yeah. and you hear uh, his voice on all of those records yeah. he, he wrote so many of those hits and people don't even know that he really wrote those hits so yeah, he, yeah. and he's still the only one that has his publishing <laughs> so he left the group but he left with his publishing so when you listen to i like he's getting I, paid yeah, I'm not <laughs> my dreams are now reality each and every time you are here with me the touch you give me with your hands will you caress my skin i'm under your command girl you hypnotize me with your eyes it <laughs> took me some time but now i realize it's you to whom which i belong i love it feelings getting strong i like that's why you hear me talking at the beginning of it I'm talking at the beginning of our life. Girl words can express the way I feel for you. The way you hold me, the way you touch me, everything you do to me, you know I like it. Don't stop now. So I thought I was, but once Aaron got on it, he knocked me out the box. He was like. <laughs>
again, it was about women. It was about girls, young girls. It was about, you know, going out or whatever. And it was almost like a fantasy to me. Because you know how you meet someone, you go home, you think that may be the one, and you dream about it the next night. <laughs> so I was always, you know, I, I was like, and it was writing about my experience, my dreams. Oh, now reality, each and every time you are here with me, the touch you give me with your hands, will you caress my skin? I'm under your command, girl. You hypnotize me with your eyes. <laughs> it took me some time, but now I realize it's you to whom which I belong. I love it. Feelings getting strong. I like. And that's how that went. Yeah, you, you make it seem as if it was so easy and straightforward. I mean, it's a very powerful track. Yeah, I know it's not easy, but it came easy to me. My goodness. Praise that's God. Good. Yeah, it came easy to me, and that's another song that I thought I was gonna sing that song. Oh, I'm, I'm glad I didn't. That's why you hear me talking at the beginning of it. I'm talking at the beginning of it, like girl words can express the way I feel for you, the way you hold me, the way you touch me, everything you do to me. You know, I like it. Don't stop now. So I thought I, <laughs> but once Aaron got on it, he knocked me out the box. He was like, <laughs> oh. it was a wrap. Yeah. So you would you you'd hear him sing and you you'd say yeah you know you go ahead it wasn't like a a, a group decision or it something. It wasn't no competition. It was like whoever sung it best, whoever did it best, whoever that song fit. Okay, it was like we wanted to do what was best at that particular time. We wanted to do what was best for the group. How this group was going to get on. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for being part of the Halftime Chat community. Please remember to like, share and subscribe. Uh, but most importantly, why don't you consider being a member as a way of supporting the channel, but also getting a lot of videos ahead of time, a lot of behind the scenes stuff and some exclusive content that doesn't get shared. But anyway, thanks for watching and thanks for being part of Halftime Chat.